and just sneezed on a model. As a result, it was raining outside the window. He looked down and took a closer look. He realized that the model in front of him was almost identical to the town he was in. Even on the top floor of the church, there was another little man just like him standing. Jack had an idea. He pulled out the tree from the model, and the tree in the town took off in the same place. Highly intelligent. He instantly realized that the model could directly manipulate the real town. He poured water around the church without saying a word. As a result, there was indeed a heavy rainstorm around him. But on the other side of the town, the sky was clear. People were talking about the weird weather. And the goddess, Ellie also complained to him. The paint that was put on the house yesterday in the dining room was messed up by this sudden rainstorm. Hearing this Jack smiled slightly. He took the nail varnish away her desk when Ellie wasn't looking, and then he painted the entire dining room with it. The next day, Ellie was amazed at what she saw. The dining room had been transformed overnight into her favorite color, orange, while Jack was secretly rejoicing. An old lady suddenly fell down. It turns out there's a hole in the road that hasn't been repaired in years. The old lady said she told the town headman about it countless times, but even though the resident's suggestion box was full of letters, the town's problems have not been alleviated in the slightest. Jack realized he shouldn't be so selfish. He should have used the model for the good of the town. Jack brought the resident's suggestion box back to his house. He was ready to meet the resident's demands one by one. Stick a booger in it. The holes were instantly filled. Use tweezers a few times. The rubbish on the roadside disappeared without a trace. Jack also uses air conditioning. Turned up the heat for the town all night so the residents could get a good night's sleep. But this weird scene made the dog downstairs bark furiously in fear. In order to gag him, Jack put a leftover bone on his side. Now the dog won't have to worry about food for three years. The next day, Jack took to the street to admire his masterpiece. But to his surprise, the residents thought the town headman had done it. They decided to vote to re-elect him. And what's even more outrageous, this shameless town headman even admitted it. Jack was furious. Looking at the town headman's red sports car, Jack was determined to show him how it's done.